Welcome back to Hey Ma. Here is my first attempt at doing a skull resin mold. This mold was purchased from Let's Resin and I'm going to put a lot of different kind of media in there from mica powder to different types of sparkles and different types of fake lamp. I just want to see how it all kind of reacts to the skull. Here I'm putting some pearlesque white mica powder in. I think I used pink too and maybe a little bit of like a lavender. I think when it comes out you can't really tell the difference between the pink and the lavender. Also going to use regular sparkles Then I also have little types of gem like sparkles and also some silver Leaf, which let me tell you, silver leaf, that's a mess. This is the two part resin that I use. It's a one to one ratio and really no complaint. It was pretty good. Obviously this video is sped up, but I mixed it very slowly and then I didn't have too many bubbles at the end, which is actually pretty unique because I use a lot of different things. I'm putting everything in this resin. So here I'm using some colorant to, to, to dye it so that it has a little bit of uh, blue in there. I've heard that uh, that will keep it from yellowing over time. Here's where I start adding everything to the resin. So I, the way that I did it, I added everything to the resin and then I poured it into the mold other than the flowers. I'm going to end the voiceover right now because my neighbor's lawn service has just arrived and you can pretty much see what I'm doing. Okay, enjoy! Oh, and don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you're enjoying the video. Thanks!
Yeah, there's bubbles in there. I never care about bubbles. <laughs> I do a little bit, but there's a couple bubbles, but it's on the bottom. So hopefully there won't be any in the top. And let's see what we got. Actually, let's move this back up a little bit. Let's see. Everybody seems to struggle with opening this, so let's, hopefully it won't be too hard. I think the rolling method is the best. Just kind of like pantyhose. Just roll it off. If you hear weird sounds, it's uh, Dean drinking on the table. I have this water dish. You gotta do the pantyhose technique here. So this is the mold from Let's Resin. Oh, look, at, look at how this the silver is like floating in there. Isn't that cool? So the flower, I don't think the flower came out like I it would because it's kind of hidden inside. Maybe that will look better with a clear, completely clear one. But look at that. It's so sparkly, right? That's so cool. So some of the, I don't, I don't know, if, do I like, I do like the sparkles though. Yeah. Maybe, maybe I did too much. It's fine. See, you got, you can see the little pearl esque. I think that's just enough to highlight the areas that I wanted to be highlighted, the definition. But then around here, you get to see. I think I would probably try this without the flower, like just either this kind of plant or the flower. Because you can't really see the flower with all the different confetti stuff in there. Okay. So that's pretty cool. That's my first, uh, look at the top. Can you see that? This is my first skull. I'll try to get a nice shot with it being uplit. It's pretty cool. 